Our story begins at a lovely afternoon at the Krusty Krab. All right, boys, today we have a really important meeting here in the office. What's the big issue, Mr. Krabs? Is the restaurant under okay? Yes, it is. The food critic came by yesterday. Ooh, he did? Yes, and he's been telling me a lot about the Krusty Krab, how nice it is, how friendly the service is, and how wonderful the food is. But that's the issue, it's the food. We don't have enough menu, we don't have enough items on the Krusty Krab menu. That's why we're going to come up with a new item. Any suggestions? Ooh, I'm pretty good with ideas. Mr. Krabs, do we why do we seriously need a new menu item? Aren't the Krabby Patties good enough? Yes, Squidward, the Krabby Patties are good enough, but we can't just keep serving Krabby Patties here. But that's what the restaurant is known for. I know, but we need to serve something different. Ooh, ooh, I know, Mr. Krabs. How about we make, um, Krusty Nuggets? What the heck is that? It's like, um, chicken nuggets, but it's made from the Krusty Krab, and we, can, and we deep fry them. Um, I don't think people want Krusty Nuggets, SpongeBob. Oh, no, oh, okay, well, good. Well, that sounds like a good idea. How about you, Squidward? I don't have any ideas. Well, you guys better come up with them by the end of the day, or else I'm gonna fire both of you guys. Come on, Squidward, come up with an idea. I don't know any ideas, okay? I, I, I really don't want to have this conversation right now. Wait a second, Mr. Krabs, I think I figured out what, what our new menu items should be. What is it? Spit it out, so I'm about to tell me. I'm not gonna tell you, Mr. Krabs. I'd rather go in the kitchen, make it up, and I'll show it to you. Well, you bought you well, okay, but you have three minutes. Oh, it's gonna take less than three minutes, sir. Well, you're the fry cook, so why not you go ahead and do it? I hope it sounds delicious. If it's not, I'm not gonna eat it. You don't have to eat it, Squidward. You always have to talk back, don't you? All right? All right you know what? I'm not gonna argue right now. I'm just gonna go inside the kitchen and go ahead and make the special item for the Krusty Krab menu. Oh, man, you guys are gonna love me when I make these. Uh, Mr. Krabs, I'm really worried about this new menu item that someone's gonna put to the Krusty Krab. What are you talking about? You haven't seen it yet. I mean, it's gonna sound disgusting, right? What do you mean, disgusting? Just wanna make sure the Krabby Patty steak is really delicious, but he's making a new menu item. Well, that's what I meant, Mr. Krabs. Well, you want me to stay in here? No, I want to go back in there and run the cash register. Alright, I'll go ahead and do that, sir. Good, now leave. Alright, talk to you later, Mr. Krab. Oh boy, I cannot wait to bring back this this really special menu item to the Krusty Krab. Now, Mr. Krab, screw will think I will be the best fry cook ever. Well, stop talking. It's time for the musical montage. Hit it! Perfecto! Now time to make more! Oh yes! My masterpiece is finally complete! The Pretty Patties have returned! Yes! I'm, I was waiting for a long time to bring these back. But I was, I was afraid to, because I thought Mr. Krabs would freak out again. But he's gonna think I'm a genius! Mr. Krabs, Squidward, come to the kitchen immediately! This is huge! What the heck was all that screaming going on in the kitchen, Mr. Krabs? I don't know, I think he's probably must have enjoyed himself making the new menu item. Hey guys, I'm finished! You guys can come to the kitchen now. Would it better be good? Yeah, I hope so, or else we get in my bark bag again. Well, Mr. Krabs and Squidward, feast your eyes on the returning item of the Krusty Krab. What the heck are those multicolored patty patties? What are those things? Come on, Mr. Krabs, don't tell me you, don't, you forgot about them that already. What are those? Tell me. The pretty patties, remember? Wait, you mean those hideous Krabby patties with the colors in them? Yes, I'm bringing them back, Mr. Krabs. It's been a, it's been a very long time since we served these. And we still had it on the menu, but people never got a chance to. Come on, Mr. Krabs, this will be a perfect opportunity. People might enjoy them like they, but people might enjoy them even more since the last time they had them. Wow, I cannot believe you're bringing back a really old item to the menu. Exactly, the old, the old pretty pet was disgusting anyway. Look at the purple one. The purple one looks like Barney the Dinosaur's ball sacks. Squidward, please stop saying those insults, alright? Alright, I'm very sorry. But are you sure the customers are going to enjoy them? Yes, and the good news is that these Krabby Patties have has fruit flavors in them. What? Yes, I'll demonstrate each of them for you guys to tell you which flavor is which. Alright, it does sound delicious. Okay, Mr. Krabs and Squirrels, it's time for me to put a little knowledge on your behinds. Now, each Pretty Patty has a different fruit flavor based off of its color. The red Pretty Patty tastes like cherries because it's red. The orange Pretty Patty tastes like oranges because it's based off of its color. The yellow Pretty Patty has a nice citrusy lemon taste. The blue Pretty Patty is a blue 
blueberry taste. The green one is a lime, and the purple one is grape. Does that sound delicious to you guys? Lime? Lemon? We trying to do sour to customers? Well, no, it's not it's not a really sour taste. It just has the it just has the sweetness of them. Well, I think they do taste appetizing, but I need to take a bite of one of them to see if, 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 if these are suitable. Oh, taste 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 program and dirty. Alright, Spud, I'm about to try one of your pretty patties. I'm gonna try the red one first. So it tastes like cherries? Yep, it does taste like cherries, Mr. Krabs. Alright, let me go ahead and take a bite of it. Mmm. <laughs> Has that natural cherry f taste. Wow, Spongebob, I'm actually am pretty impressed that you brought back the pretty patties. Has the nice fruit flavor to them. Now it means we can serve them. For real? Yes. And I can already hear the first customer coming in. Ooh, I wonder who it is. Mr. Squibber, why don't you give the other Krabby Patties to the, to the next few set of customers? Why do I have to deliver the Krabby Patties? Because I made them. No, wait, they're not called Krabby Patties, Squidward. They're called Pretty Patties. There's nothing pretty about them. Shut up and serve the cra pretty, pretty Patties. All right, fine. I'll go ahead and serve up the first set of customers. Well, good afternoon, Squidward. <sighs> Sandy, what are you doing here? Well, I stopped by for some lunch. Um, I'll have a Krabby Patty meal, please. Um, Krabby Patty meal? Yes. Um, um... We're not serving Krabby Patties at the moment. Then what are you guys serving then? We're serving these Krabby Patties called Pretty Patties that SpongeBob made and I think... What's a Pretty Patty? Never heard of them before. <laughs> They're basically these Krabby Patties that are like colorful and whatnot and... Um, is it delicious? Oh, no, oh, oh it's, it's your innocent opinion, Sandy. Why don't you just order one? Um, what are the colors? Um, red, yellow, green, blue, and purple and orange. Oh, colors are the rainbow, okay. Um, I'll have a red one, please. Alright. Hey, Spongebob, we need one red Pretty Patty, please. Alright, I'm coming. Alright, I'll give it to you. Oh, so you're the c paying customer, Sandy. I didn't even knew you were stopping by here. Well, I was hungry, and I wanted something to eat, so the Crunchy Crab was, was my only option. Oh, okay. Well, here's the red Pretty Patty that you ordered. Um, so can you, like, give me a, a description of what it's supposed to taste like? Well, um, each Pretty Patty... Has a different color. Yes, Squidward told me already. Did he tell you it has a fruit flavor? Wait, it tastes like fruit? Yes, it has a different c flavor of fruit. So the red one is cherries. Oh, I do like cherries, but are you sure it's delicious? Yes, it's really good. Why don't you have a try of it? Okay, I'll try and if it, and if I like it, I'll pay you money. Good. All right, Spongebob, here comes my very first pretty party experience. All right, just take a nice bite of it and tell me how. what do you think about it. Um, Sandy, you don't look a little okay. Are you sure that Pretty Patty's is making you feel better? Um, it has a weird taste to it. What are you talking about? I, I taste chemicals. <gasps> chemicals? Wait, what do you mean chemicals? I mean, I took a bite of it. There is a little cherry flavor, but all I but there's a hint of cherry, and then the rest is just chemicals. I think I don't feel so good. What are you talking about, Sandy? What do you mean you don't feel good? Uh, I should, I, I, um, are you sure? You, are, is this even edible? Oh, yes, it's edible. It's, it's supposed to be a Pretty Patty, right? It tastes like chemicals! Well, I'm- um, Wait, what do you mean chemicals? Spongebob, what do you put on the pretty patties? I didn't do anything, Squidward! Well, 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 if it isn't the Krusty Crew, how's everybody doing today? I'm not too well, Patrick. What are you talking about? Wait a second. Um, Sandy, you don't look a little too well. Are, are, is something okay? No, Patrick, I don't feel too good. No, what are you talking about, Sandy? So, Spongebob made these pretty patties, right? And it tastes like chemicals. Spongebob, wait, what do you mean it tastes like chemicals? I mean, I took a- I mean... I took a bite of it, it's supposed to be like cherries, right? Because it's red and it, it, it has a hint of cherry, then, it, then afterwards it has a really disgusting chemical taste. <gasps> what, so someone was putting chemicals in the pretty patties? What is, what is a pretty patty? Well, Patrick, I'm not putting any chemicals. Well, Squirt, Patrick, Patrick, I'll be happy to tell you what a pretty patty is. It, or, it's these colorful crabby patties that Spongebob made, and he's turning out that he's making people sick. Spongebob, did you put any chemicals in the crabby patty? Look, you guys! I did, I did not do anything to the pretty patties. All I did was was use. I used. All I did was make regular pretty patties, put some food coloring dye, then I add some fruit flavoring into them to make them taste like the real thing. Well, well, why did, well, well if it is, then why is it tasting chemicals? I don't know. Then probably you're not tasting it right. So I do not feel like arguing right now. I'm really sick. Then go home and stop your drama. All right? You're about to make me very angry. Well, smart girl, you really need to calm down. Why don't you just shut up, Patrick, and stay out of it? Mr. Sp Griffin, I need to talk to you. What is it, Mr. Krabs? I'm arguing with Patrick and stupid Sandy over here. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna come out there and talk to you then. I really don't not feel like hearing all these. If you don't stop your drama, I'm gonna shove that whole sandwich out your gullet. All right, Mr. Krabs, what the heck do you want now? Well, I've had um, I have I have had two of your pretty patties, and I'm starting to get a really, really disgusting, bitter chemical taste in my mouth. 
Are you kidding me? You guys are still complaining about the chemical nest. There are no chemicals in the pretty patties. Yes, there is one. I'm really, really sick, okay? Now stop your arguing. Go home if you're sick then. Gee, why are you still here? That's why you better tell me why are the pretty patties tasting like chemical weed? You guys want the truth? I'm gonna give you guys the truth, okay? So you guys can get off my back. Good. Then go inside that kitchen and show me where you where those chemically nests from the pretty patties are coming from. I'll be happy to, Mr. Krabs. Goodness, all there is is drama, drama, drama every second of the dang on day. And I'm tired of it. Here you go, Sandy. I got you some water to make, to make the bitterness go away from your mouth. Why, thank you, Patrick. I really appreciate it. At least you're smart for once. I'm really about tired of hearing some of drama. I'm the one who's having drama. You're the one who's whining like a little five-year-old right now. Oh, yeah. Give me the water. Yeah, here you go, Sandy. Don't listen to SpongeBob.